or the fight team um, uh, boxing trunks tonight. Partner, why is this one of the most anticipated bout of Daluyong ng mga kamao? Because both fighters are tough fighters and um, alam nila na, na may maganda silang mapapanood uh, when these two fighter is fighting inside the ring. Definitely, partner. Let's take a look at Jason Dohel, you know, with 10 wins and 8 losses. Some of his notable wins are over uh, uh, Kevin Asinero uh -huh. and uh, Kim Lindog also and Jerry Canyada. Ito namang si uh, Ivor Lastrilla, partner. Um, you know, we all know how he, tough he is, he, you know. Uh, uh, I think Ivor Lastrilla is in the same mode as us, a fighter who nakalaban na lahat right. na ng, ng magagaling na fighter sa division niya. And he also won, not just in the Philippines, but abroad. Ah. He's won a couple of fights against uh, Japanese opponents. So parehong boxer na to talagang um, they are tough as nails. They both have the skills and now they are looking to to make a good impression in their comeback fight. Itong si Ivor Lastrilla, we last saw him uh, against Roy Sumuga ano, in uh, 2022. And uh, Jason Dohel, you last saw him also in 2022 against Rodex Piala. There you have it. Both boxers, as you can see, are defensively responsible. They're using that jab. A counter upper by uh, Lastrilla. Lastrilla trying to pummel the body and break the guard of Jason Dohelio. Jason Dohelio remains with that tight guard. Stays in the pocket. Counters with that jab. Alam mo ang sinasabi nila yung, yung kulang doon sa Jason Dohelio is is a proper uh, trainer and proper facilities. Sabi niya may husay talaga tong uh, batang to kaya lang. Right. Um, minsan pag wala kang manager, wala kang stable, medyo lagi kang dihado. Of course, Pero of right course. Right now I think um uh, LRD fight team is uh, helping him. Hopefully um uh, magkaroon sila ng harmony, harmonic relationship. The same with uh, Ivor Lastrilla right now, as you can see, he's sporting the Gosama uh, Fitness uh, or he's uh, carrying the name of Gosama Fitness. Nakita naman natin gano ka ganda yung gym. I'm very, very sure they're also supporting Ivor Lastrilla. So, we can see both boxers in this uh, fight. Both of them, I'm pretty sure they've prepared for this fight. Ivor Lastrilla just setting up those body punches. There you have it. End of round one. Let's see some of the best uh, shots of that round. That is a body hook by uh, Lastrilla and an overhand. Although Dohelio was also able to counter a few times. What I like about Dohelio is he's uh, he can take a punch. He can sacrifice uh, by taking a punch para maka counter siya. And in his corner, uh, also wearing the Elorde shirt is uh, Coach Tasi uh, Makalos. Parang hindi araw-araw ganun yan. <laughs> Pero um, uh, so, I think um, it's very fit uh, for Coach Tasi with that uh, Elorde fight team uh, shirt. No? Medyo bagay na bagay pala sa kanya yung pink and white. Diba? Here we go. Here we go, partner. Okay, nanon. Alam mo, si Pinoy Ali. Si Pinoy Ali, kilala mo? Oh, naman. Uh, the WBF Asia Pacific Flyweight Champion, uh, Argelu Dalugdog, is watching right now from PMI Boxing, uh, Bohol Boxing Stadium. Si uh, Roy Duligues din nanonood sa atin from Beijing, uh, China, isa rin yan Oy. sa ating mga oh. boxers and MMA fighters. Si Robin Langres din nanonood sa atin. Taga-Takloban to sinabi niya sa akin. I-shoutout ko siya. Ngayon nasa Thailand siya. Wala siya sa Ilorde. <laughs> Ayan, si Boss Marty natin, uh, Champ Robin, ay nandito sa likod. Nandito sa likod namin. So here we are right now, round number two, Lastrilla versus Dohelio. A minute, almost minute has elapsed, 
and they're both feeling out there's a huge uppercut pero na block ni Lastrilla yung uppercut ni Dohelio a fence of jabs from both boxers this is gonna be an interesting uh, next five rounds partner sooner or later I think the pace will pick up with these two fighters partner alam natin slugger pareho tong dalawang fighter na to uh, once na magka-amoya na to eh. right. sunod-sunod na to but they have the finish ng mga boxers who have fought so many fights already because yeah, as yeah. you can see they're picking their shots they're cautious they're not overly committing on a punch na alam nila hindi tatama so we can see right here two veterans uh, taking on ano, uh, Wa each other watching right now is the current WBO Oriental Minimum Weight Champion RR Acero R uh, Andales from Kibor Boxing stable here in in um, um, Molino Bacoor. Right. So as you can see both boxers are tightly guarded and all those power shots yeah. by Ivor Lastrilla. He's trying to slice through that guard of uh, Jason Dohelio. Same thing kay Jason partner. Tignan mo. He's trying to catch Ivor with a huge shot pero si Ivor has that head movement ano. And um very decent din yung yung uh, Lep jab no ng uh, Doh Dohelio constantly na nandoon uh, trying to break the ice of the the, the power punches of uh, Ivor Lastrilla. Right, and then you see Ivor slipping to the right. Ano, he has that shoulder up. He missed with that overhand. Final uh, twenty seconds of round two part. Mm -hmm. Ar Ariel Al Alapormina is uh, watching right now. Um, sa isa sa mga kaibigan natin at masugid na pagkasubaybay din. Salamat, salamat. Partner, this is such a beautiful exchange. You can see both yeah. boxers trying to break into each other's guards, waiting for an opportunity, for an opening. Ano? Kasi pareho silang tightly guarded. So what an exchange by both boxers. After this bout, yung lahat ng nag-aabang kay Ariel Antonio, siya na yung susunod dito sa laban na to. Again, we would like to thank yung ating mga Eagles, um, fraternity ng Eagles for supporting this event also. Palapit na tayo ng palapit doon sa, sa ating mga, mga main event. Uh, our main event is a uh, PBF Pantaboy Championship, Justin Darap of uh, Calbayog City. He will be battling Carlo De Mesilio of Big Yellow Boxing Gym. Cebu City. Tsaka yung special attraction natin, Miyoto Noguchi of MR Boxing Gym in Osaka, Japan. He will be fighting Jesse Chris Rosales of Taliban Bohol, 6 round, 140 pound. There you have it. Round number three of this uh, featherweight bout between Australia in the red and black trunks and Jason Dohelio wearing uh, the red and white trunks. Pa, alam ko si Wesley Kaga may laban to eh. Oo. Oh, oh. oh, binababati niya yung uh, isa kong inaanak na si Jassel Trinidad na isang PBF uh, champion also. Nanonood ba kayo dyan sa, ano, sa labas ng barak? Siguro. <laughs> sa malaking TV oh. eh. Oo. Oh, oh. Yan si Wesley, ano yan, nagbatang Pinoy yan, isang magaling na amateurista. And he will be fighting, his baby fight for Elorde. Uh, fight team and, uh, on and big heart Kenny Dimisilio is also watching right now I think that's a general Santos yeah, if I'm not mistaken um, Ivor Da Silla is trying to connect with some um, straight uh, jab and, and body punches too ano medyo underrated lang yung Duhelio pero magaling dumiskarte din tong oh, batang oh, to partner, he, no? look at his guard it's just so tight he can barely punch through mm. his elbows ano? and, and he's always there to counter and partner eh, I'm sure uh, you will agree with me the job of Duhelio is constantly there uh, right and he's uh, that that's uh, his reflex uh, has not uh Rusted out, no? you can still see him countering pretty well. At the same time, itong si Ivor is a. You can see him now, no? he's showing us what a body puncher he is. He really is set on uh, 
punishing the body and right now the head of Jason Dorelli. Uh, a, a mini flurry by uh, by uh, Ivor Lasilla, but most of the sh the punches did caught the 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 gloves of uh, Dorelli. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh. A job by Dohelio. <laughs> Mr. Biendima is, is my idol. The bull. The bull. Um, iba yan, iba yan si the bull. Talagang uh, bumigay ang kamay ng uh, champion. <laughs> Na injure dahil sa ulo ni Biendima. Hindi naman matawag yung double yan kung walang ano. Imaginein mo, Lucas Biendima gave a hard time. Coach Rene Lior Arizalo also watching. I think he's from in China right now. Yes, Coach Bong. Thank you for watching. Another chess match of a round for these two veterans. There you have it. Respect by both the boxers shown at the end of the round. A very, very, a very classy and a technical fight partner. Diba? Sabi naman ni Junior Villa, they have to let their hands go. Yes, eventually, because um, you have to solve the puzzle. Uh, at least uh, right now, you know, we're going into the fourth round. You have to, by now, already have solved the puzzle. And amp it up or step on the gas pedal. Yes. I think both of the fighters will do it. Because this is a six-round affair. So, kailangan may onting risk. Oh, kailangan magano ka. Sumugal ka, sumugal ka for you to take this win. And I think some feints will also, or some. Some some misdirection and feints can also work for both bosses. Because right now, magaling sila pareho gumasa ng galaw. They can read each other's movements. So let's see, let's see what adjustments are gonna be made here, partner. Round number four: Dohelio in the white and red trunks, Lastrilla in the red and black trunks. There you go. They're using that pawing jab, you know, that jab to sort of like disrupt the rhythm. I think, mm -hmm. I think, uh, I don't know if you agree with me. I think both of the fighters talagang well conditioned partner. Oh, naman. Uh, Makita mo sa stance nila, sa hinga, na, sa hinga nila. I think both of them did prepare for this fight. And even the relaxed uh, state, you know, of their bodies. Um, both of them are quick to their feet. They're not getting off balance uh, a lot. Oh, there you have it. Uh, Lastrilla pumping that uh, body of Dohelio. Dohelio answers with a double jab. What a beautiful uh, white uh, Pertex club. Um, together with the glory club. Both of the gloves are. And of course, our boss. Ma'am Coco Elorde. Uh, who is, I think, watching us from uh, Sukat Paranaque. Um, we will be having the UKC showdown uh, on October 28th in the, the Flash Grand Ballroom. Uh, please support, and uh, it will be also shown live uh, sa Elorde TV. October 28th, the weigh-in will be on October 27th, roughly around 10 o'clock in the morning. Right. A jab to the head and body by Castrilla to set up that overhand. Dohelio answers with a stiff jab. That straight missed for Dohelio. Partner, sabi ni Coach Bong nanonood siya sa subway. Nakakataba ng puso. Na kahit na <laughs> nasa biyahe yung mga tao, nanonood sila. Salamat, salamat. Um, we are only an instrument um, to bring you this kind of a boxing. I mean, um, this is this this feed is, is, is free. Uh, given to them so hopefully mag, uh, mag enjoy kayo uh, sa um, sa bigay ng Elorde TV in cooperation also with High End Punch Up Boxing Promotion who is very instrumental on bringing uh, boxing back in Tacloban City mm -hmm. there you have it a left consecutive left shots by Jason Dohelio 
Ivor Lastrila tries to open up a closely guarded Dohelio. Oh, a big uh, left hand from Ivor Lastrilla. <laughs> Franklin, Franklin NL Mendoza is uh, watching um, from South Korea. Thank you for watching. And I hope you all enjoy. Marami pa po tayong, ano, marami pa po tayong handog. I think five more matches, uh, including the main event and co-main event. I'm sure uh, it's worth the wait na, na hintayin nyo ang, ang, ang mga huling limang laban, including the Japanese versus Filipino uh, matches. Match, I'm sure. Right. And uh, Trigun uh, Navi, shout out po kay Roderick Samonte from Dawis, Bohol. Jimboy Corales, go Kuya Ivor. Jimboy Corales uh, from uh, San Joaquin, uh, late. Part na naalala mo si Ivor Lastrilla also went against Virgil Vitor in Bohol. Yes, yes. And uh, we were there, no? Uh, I think at, at na, naaalala ko siya yung trunks niya from his old uh, fighting o, days pa, Almost, no? almost masira na. Yeah. Sa, sa sobrang tagal. And then um, you could see his toughness against Virgil yes, Vitor. For and, sure. Um, with the huge cut na nangyari din sa kanya lumapan pa rin siya up to the end that's how tough is Ibor Lastrilla for sure ito namang si Jason uh, Dohel yo partner um, he, sabi mo nga kanina a lot of people see the the potential in him and are happy to see him back inside the ring ano? I, I, I hope uh, Jason uh, Dohel yo do give um, importance dito sa latest comeback niya. Right. Uh, sana kasi hindi naman lahat ng boxer will be given a chance to 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 be back on the ring or or, or to have a chance again. Uh, dapat as a boxer we must maximize yung mga chances na binigay sa atin ng mga promoter. Right. And I hope yun nga eh this featherweight fight between these two boxers nakikita natin ano iron sharpens iron. You really get better when you fight better mm, opponents yeah. and as we can see right now this is proving to be a uh, chess match for these two boxers who can't seem to figure out ano kailangan makita nila eh, yung Achilles heel nung isa't isa mm. now uh, Lastrilla is trying to pin Duhelio on the rope pero magaling gumawa, lumam, gumamit ng lubid si Duhelio ever since na nakita ko siya uh, magaling gumamit yan and, and sometimes parang possum lang siya sa ano yeah. pero he will he will counter with with several yeah, kakaya there yan. you have it huge lifts parang Muhammad Ali yan partner yung rope dope diba ginagamit mo yung rope to absorb the punch for I, you I just wanna greet and thanks this three boxer who is watching right now Marky Bermaldez um, may, ana, may inaanak Jericho Gachalian and uh, may other inaanak Ryan Rakasa mm -hmm. uh, I think Ryan Nakasa is uh, having a, 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 comeback, boys, so a comeback fight uh, very, very soon. This, this, this boy, Ryan Nakasa, is as strong as a bull. Mm -hmm. And uh, everybody is waiting for his comeback. A danger yeah. to anyone. Eh? Undefeated lightweight yan, right. partner. Uh, Ryan Nakasa. Coach Janex, shout out daw sa mga taga Jab Street Boxing. Ooh, that was a huge uh, uh, left by Jason Dohelio. Oh, mirror. <laughs> There you have it. Uh, end of round number five of a six-round uh, affair. I hope Jericho Gachalian could have another shot at boxing. This boy is a stamp as a nail also. Um, I am um, waiting for a comeback fight for Jericho Gachalian uh, sooner or later. Hopefully soon. And... Coach Jetro Pabustan ng Elorde 
a... El Guapito. El Guapito. Uh, shout out daw kay Kevin Lim. Naku, Coach Jetro, yung uh, mukha ninyo ni Laben Ligas at ni uh, Jong Baldonado ay uh, naka-flash sa malaking uh, screen dito mm. sa Tacloban. Maraming maraming salamat po. This is the only way para para mabigyan nyo ng support kami as a commentator. You, you just uh, kindly like and share Elorde TV and share this video at sana dumami pa yung uh, nanonood sa atin ngayon. Uh, and we would provide you with a good and tough and um, boxing uh, competition given by High and Punch boxing promotion straight from Tax Global City. Yes, and here we are in round 6, Ivor Lastrilla versus Jason Dohelio, triple jab by uh, Lastrilla partner. Yes, uh, coach Florence Perez is watching right Ay, now. Ako, ang ating coach, magiting na coach at sa ating mga Philippine Navy boxers, uh, hello po sa inyo. Quick counter by uh, Dohelio. I like how Dohelio counters with that left hand, ano? That stiff uh, job of his. What I like about Dohelio is his defense partner. Uh -oh. uh, sabi ko nga, maraming suntok yung uh, Lastrilla, but very underrated yung defense ng Dohelio. Um, some of the punches are caught on the on the arms. Mm. Pero don to mama right. yung uh, Lastrilla ng ano ng uh, counter na right. And what I like about Ivor Lastrilla, his punches, yung mga hindi to matama, he uses that to gather information yeah. kung paano niya mapapasukan si Dohelio during openings, ano? So and both of these boxers partnered are undoubtedly cerebral boxers. Ayun, partner. And Dohelio is a sport is sporting a throwback cycling short. <laughs> partner, that was a 90s version of Ay, a cycling alam, short. Ay, hindi ko alam, hindi pa ako boy ng 90s eh. Because of some of the <laughs> professional boxer is is a uh, having that kind of a style oh, way, back, length, way back uh -oh. on the 90s oh, oh. alam mo naman ang buhay pa eh, pa ikot ikot lang eh Tama. Wa, ano yung sumikat nung 90s eventually it will come back on the on 2000 2023 it will come back pa ikot ikot lang actually iba ibang style ng boxing shorts si itong si Dohelio is nandun sa shorter side ano Itong si Ivor Lastrilla, yung medyo uh, mahaba, mm. which is reminiscent of yung mga panahon ni Roy Jones Jr. Yeah, yeah. Ito naman si Dohelio. Yung, yung mini shorts, panahon niya nila, ano, nila... Uh, <laughs> ayoko, baka mapagkamalan akong buhay na nung panahon na yun eh. Pero yung mga Roger Mayweather era, uh, ganyan. Yes, yes. Julio Cesar Chavez. Julio Cesar yes, Chavez yes. also. Mm. Si Jimmy Cano po ay, uh, I think, meron pa pong uh, tatlong laban bago si Jimmy Cano. So, sa lahat ng nag-aantabay sa kanya, uh, you, you just stick around and try to be patient at darating din po tayo sa ating co-main event. Oh, uh, what Ivor Lasvila did in there? He tried to, he tried to add muscle uh, uh, Dohelio and stick that uppercut, but that was a... Uh, a uh, cerebral match between two veterans, Jason Dahelio and yes, Ivor Lastrilla. Yes. Oo, tama. Tama ka dun. Gusto ko lang batiin yung uh, isang tao na pinaka-importante sa akin, si Antonio Crossman. Uy! Gano? Napaka-importante. Na-interview nga ako ng no other than Sir Jerry Peñalosa kanina. Ah. <laughs> Tungkol sa love life ko. <laughs> Napaka-importante pala. Napaka-swerte talaga ni Crossman. Ako din naman. Yan ay, yan ay ano lang uh, Ever since uh, I told these two people uh, Mahalaga din sa akin uh, To enjoy the moment and, Yes Shoutout daw na si John Manuel, Manuel Lair. Shoutout daw kay Efren Segovia. Salamat at salamat sa panonood ninyo. And uh, enjoy watching. Ang susunod pa laban na po natin ay eh, lahat ng mga nag-aantabay. Si Jeffrey Basil. 
against Ariel Antonio. Ariel Antonio is from a Jump Street uh, boxing gym in San Pedro, Laguna. And Jeffrey Basin is from Tasi Makalot boxing team in Padre Burgos, Southern Leyte. At tapos po niyan yung Jubel Salina na at saka Monigo Laurente. After six rounds of professional we boxing, we will go partner. to the scorecards. Judges Ray Caitom and Noel Flores both scored it 58 to 56. And Judge Gerald Tomeldan scored it 59 to 55. All for the winner by unanimous decision. John Ivor Lastrilla. It was a unanimous decision win for